everybody this is christy from kitty underscore plans on instagram i do memory planning in my a5y planner and rs style inserts and for this week i am using this beautiful beautiful kit from sticker guru called cardinal song i used to pr for them so at this time i was given this kit and it's so so beautiful and they have this is like a sub kit of theirs or their sub box their monthly sub box and it's always um original uh, artwork so it also comes along with deco and this beautiful foil and yeah do stick around while i put down the base and i'll talk to you in a while Alright, so for the date headers this week, I will be using this uh, lovely floral washi from My Spoiled Planner. So I really have a lot. So you've seen my past spreads if you were, uh, you've been watching my past spreads that I've always been using the My Spoiled Planner floral washi. So it's really good for the date headers, especially if the kit doesn't have like um, the florals that I like to use on top of the page. So yeah, that's what I just did. I just put down the date headers from the kit and then I'm putting this lovely uh, garland from Miss and Meow and that is it for my date headers. So, so pretty. Okay, for the sidebar, I am putting down this like oval from the journaling kit and then I'm putting down this deco from the kit as well and silver foil for the month part. The script is from Letters to Apollo and then this is the really cute part. I love doing I love doing this one. This is from the Giving Girl. It's like a build your build your snowman, build your own snowman. So <laughs> yeah, it's so so fun that you're able to build it like with just stickers um um pretty pretty cute snowman and then yeah i i really went well with the sidebar so i just love using the giving girl uh journaling and stickers so yeah do check her out because she's got a lot of stuff um really cute stuff and that is for my sidebar and then above it i'll be putting down one of the full boxes and then the header would be from the kit as well a red header and then for more of a foil pop i used like the um like the snow this one the snow snowflakes from the foil from the silver foil that was part of this bundle so I just put down the rest of the full boxes and yeah, that is it for my bases.
right so for the day today i will be using this uh, deco sheet for my to mark my work and the script is from paper trail plans so i put down another deco from kit is cute skates ice skates and then a like reading sticker from hello petite paper and a reading sesh from paper trail plants i was reading holiday romance well not actually reading it was an audiobook so i mistakenly um subscribed to like the audiobook um app and then there's like a free credit so i'm like why not take up the uh, free credit and i tried this holiday romance and then it's my first time like listening to an audiobooks audiobook and it was like um uh i wasn't used to it because you like really have to listen so i was thinking i could do other stuff um while listening but then i don't know my my, my mind wasn't focused on the book so i think yeah i i unsubscribed from that um monthly app and yeah i'd rather just read it the holiday romance is like a christmas story it's really funny i mean um the book was was okay a lot of people like this book but then for me because i couldn't understand it so much i wasn't able to um, appreciate it but yeah um that was fine i still read I, I still listened to that and then we also went to the grocery run and then for movie night i watched the naughty nine with my daughter i can't remember what the story is about maybe about kids for something Mm, can't remember <laughs> so i'm putting down these two rectangles together and then some more deco and um where did we go this time so i went to costco so yes yeah, so we went to costco this time my husband was feeling better and we went there. but once we were there because he was just he had a long bout with covid but um when we were there he was like he wanted to get out of the house because he was like in the house for like more than 10 days because of his sickness um and then finally he was able to get out but when we were in costco he suddenly felt not too well maybe so we did all the rest of the groceries while he stayed in the car he also got some pizza for dinner this big you know this whole pizza for so cheap Costco, so of course <laughs> and then i read eight perfect hours so it's a romance story but um it's uh, another fail on the christmas book because actually i didn't uh like it so much um i didn't see any depth in it and it's like the build-up or the relationship of the um, boy and the girl was, wasn't really there so i didn't appreciate it too much so on wednesday we went for some shopping at michael's and joanne's i think i was looking for like um a a case to put all my like my um nail press stuff and then i think yeah and then now let's move on to tuesday because i left wednesday behind um what did we do so i got some amazon package and then um i was able to finish the eight perfect hours i still finished it you know i don't i didn't like i needed to plow through it plow through it because <laughs> I, don't I, I don't know i feel like i need to finish the book even if i'm not even happy with it because you know something might, good might happen right <laughs> but apparently no it didn't work out so happy mail i got some happy mail i'm putting that that like those music notes as well as part of the um part of the deco so this beautiful scarf that is from the giving girl again so if you're part of her facebook group she has this freebie and i think one of this is her freebie it's so so cute I've, it goes so well with the kit because of the colors and yeah so this friday i had a lot of meetings um, I don't know. I don't usually have this too many meetings, but this Friday, even, oh my gosh, even on a Friday, right? Usually I don't have a lot of meetings on Friday, but this Friday I had so many. I was able to organize um, the rest of my, you know, the nails that I bought into the cases that I bought from Joann's. 
and then I was reading um, Tis the Season for Revenge. Oh, okay, so it's another Christmas book fail. Um, yeah, I didn't like the spice in this book. It didn't I feel like it didn't go with the book? So um, the the story was fine. It was a fluffy kind of you know romance, but you know I didn't like the spice. It's so cringy. Uh, but that's that's me. You know, a lot of people still enjoyed it, and that's okay. So on Saturday, I was reading Divine Rivals on my physical book, and then Snowed In. Snowed In is like uh, the author was also the one who wrote holiday romance. Divine Rivals is like this famous YA book where um, it's an uh, it's like uh, they have like two typewriters that they're able to send messages so the girl and the boy like send messages to each other and there's this war going on so yeah it's a pretty cool book uh more of the action was like towards the end of the book but you know the relationship buildup was really nice i was also able to edit my plan with me and then um what else went to some H Mart and then I also had FaceTime with my family back home. On Sunday I was able to sleep in because I slept so late. Maybe I was I don't know I was probably reading <laughs> and then uh continued to read. And the Snow Inn is a better book. I read it on Kindle um and I enjoyed it better than the first book. And then we went shopping for Sophia's crafts and drawing stuff for me. So yeah, that's it for my plan with me this week. These are the leftovers that I have. Um, a lot of silver foil left. And this is it in its full spread. This is Cardinal Song by the Sticker Guru. And yeah, I'd like to thank you for watching. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye!